Need you for the old me Need you for my sanity Need you to remind me where I come from Can you do it? Hi guys, Lisa so Mari here and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, welcome and go ahead and hit the subscribe button and notification bell so you'll be notified every time I post a video. Um, if you're a returning subscriber, welcome back and thank you for watching me. I appreciate it. I love you guys and I thank you for all your, all my new subscribers, my comments, my feedback, everything. I try my best to read all the comments as best I can. Of course, I miss some, but I try. So, um, if you want to keep up with me and follow me on Instagram, my name is the same as my YouTube name, at Talise Mariah. I don't post as much as I should, but I promise to get more active on Instagram. So, um, I hate YouTubers that ramble, so we're just going to get into the topic for today's video. I just realized I wear my AirPods in every video. Like, I, I'm in love with these things. If you don't have AirPods, you should get some. They're bomb. But, um... So yeah, I um I'm coming to y'all today to review the Taraji P Henson the TPH new hair care line because I just recently tried it and I just wanted to give y'all my feedback on it since I know when I was looking I couldn't really find a lot of good feedback on it but um I don't know like I'm pregnant right now and since I've been pregnant I've always had a, a really dry scalp like so when I get like extensions like weaves or sew-ins or braids or whatever i can never wear them for that long because like i'll get flakes and stuff in my scalp and i end up having to take them out so i've tried everything i've gone to the dermatologist if i sound out of breath y'all it's because of this big belly i got right now but yeah i've gone to the dermatologist i have tried neem oil i've tried deep um i mean not deep but hot oil treatments i've tried everything but like for some reason when i was pregnant with my son my scalp was great i drank a lot of water so i know people say that i drink a lot of water and you know i try my best to eat healthy i haven't eaten the healthiest since i've been pregnant obviously but um so yeah i um i was trying to like my scalp was just so like ridiculously itchy since i've been pregnant with my daughter and um i had wanted to get my hair done the lady was like oh it could just be your hormones or whatever so I have been on the search for something that was going to help my hair and to like oil my scalp. I have been using, if you hear any noise in the back, that's my son making that noise. Don't mind that. I have been using grapeseed oil to, um, to oil my scalp. And I don't know, it just wasn't. I know it's a lot of benefits and stuff to grapeseed oil. And I cook with it a lot of times, but it wasn't working for my scalp or making my hair healthier. I felt like. So I saw, um, this girl that I follow on Instagram talking about the Taraji P. Henson line and like how it's so good that she keep always keep her conditioners and stuff like that. So I'm always doing these little drive up orders on Target now since the COVID-19 pandemic. So I was like, when well, this time I place my drive up order at Target, I'm just going to order something from the Taraji P. Henson line because I know that, you know, Target carries it. I don't know where else you can find it, but I know you can get it at Target and Amazon if you want to purchase it. So the first product that I bought to try was the mint conditioner, a tingling scalp conditioner. It's supposed to replenish, soften, moisturize, and it's for all hair types. And I don't know if y'all can see that. Oh, that's what it looks like. It's an eight ounce bottle, and I think it was about $13 at Target, I think. And the, it says it's infused with aloe, shea butter, eucalyptus oil, and peppermint. And it tells you how to use it. And it tells you you can use it daily or as desired. You put it in, let it sit for a little while, rinse it out. It has these little nozzles on it. And like when you squeeze it, the conditioner comes straight through the nozzle. She has a whole line of scalp care. The other one is a scalp scrub. And the other one is a wash. Then she has this conditioner. And then uh, like just a scalp serum. I want to try the serum, but I'm going to wait until after I give birth because the serum contains caffeine. It's one of the active ingredients, which I'm not really sure why. But anywho, um, so I tried it. I bought it one night from Target because I was just, I had taken my wig off and I was like, my scalp was just so itchy. And you know, like when I wear my wigs, I want to keep them on for longer. But a lot of times if my scalp starts itching or it's flaky, you know, I don't get to. And I was tired of just washing my hair all the time. 
And um, I had a lot of product build up from some deep, this deep conditioner that I had used from Kinsu, which I hate. Um, so I just took this and like, I took the nozzles and like rubbed it, like squeezed it and just rubbed it into my, all the areas in my scalp. And then I massaged it in. And then I put a plastic bag over my head and put a bonnet on and I went to bed. I slept with it that whole night. And then the next morning when I got up, I um, I went ahead and washed it out. I had a lot of product built up in my hair. So at that time, I also ended up washing my hair with Dawn dish soap. Because as you guys know, or if you don't know, when you have a lot of product built up in your hair and you want it out, Dawn dish soap is the way to go, whether you relax or natural. I am not natural, but I have not had a relaxer in six months because I don't get relaxers while I'm pregnant just because of the chemicals in them, but I do get them normally. Um, just because I have a lot of hair and um, it just makes it more manageable. But um, yeah, so I washed it out with some Dawn dish soap to make sure I got all the conditioner out since it had been in my hair all night and all the product built up from this other deep conditioner I used. And after that, I deep conditioned with this Crece Pelo. Um, it's like a, it's like a Dominican product. You can get it at Target or on Amazon. But if you guys have questions, let me know and I can send you the link. But um, I deep conditioned with that. I let it sit in my hair for like a couple hours. I took a nap and then I woke up, I washed it out. Then I blow dried my hair most of the way straight. And after that, I had put my, put my hair back in cornrows because I wanted to put on another wig. So I did that. And then so I've stopped using the grape seed oil because I felt like it wasn't having and I switched to this. This is a 100% pure Jamaican black castor oil head to toe restoration and it's from Shea Moisture but as you guys know you can get Jamaican black castor oil from like the Tropic Isle or whatever. I've used it before in the past but I stopped using it because I felt like it was making my hair too thick because I already have really thick hair. But um, I decided to give it another try since I have been wearing a lot of protective styles during this quarantine. And um, especially around my edges, like I want to keep them strong and make sure they continue to grow and all of that stuff. So that's what I've been using. It's been over a week now since I used the um, mint conditioner on my scalp. And it is like I have zero flakes on my scalp. I know you can't see it right now because I have on a wig, <laughs> but if I didn't, I would show you guys my scalp and I have like zero flakes. Like, and normally once I wash my hair, <laughs> oh, excuse me, I give it like two or three days and I'm back itchy again. I'm back flaky. So like, this is great. It's been a week and I'm I'm good. Like I have no flakes on my scalp. I um I, I oiled it today because I had given my hair a break and I had just put my wig back on. So I oiled it with this. Um, like throughout my whole head and then i always put this as well as the crazy payload pay conditioner on my edges before i get ready to install a new leg wig especially if i'm gonna glue it down um so yeah i love this product like i'm sold i'm gonna use more i don't really see me buying a scalp scrub but maybe I don't know. I might try maybe one of her deep conditioners or something, but I love this line. It has great products in it. It is for all of my people that are naturally conscious that don't do silicones or anything like that. It's vegan, cruelty-free, uh, paraben-free, mineral oil-free, SLS-free. I'm not really sure what that means, but um, yeah. And it has all the ingredients, a lot of good stuff like avocado oil, aloe, um, a bunch of stuff that I've never heard of but it looks good it has water in it so yeah I love this stuff I definitely say go buy it if you can't find it at your local Target I'm not sure if it's at Walmart or not I honestly don't really shop at Walmart but I know for sure it's at Target if it's not a Target near you you can order it online with Target or if not you can definitely get it at on Amazon um and that's I have the mint condition the conditioner not the scalp cleanser because they both look like they're in the same bottle. But I'm sure that one will probably work the same. But I don't know. I just love this stuff. Like, I'm using it forever because <laughs> I don't want flakes in my scalp anymore. And also this Jamaican Black Castor Oil. I got this as well as Target. But as you know, you can basically find Shea Moisture products on anywhere. Walmart, CVS, Walgreens, whatever. And I think I paid about 10 bucks for this. And this 1.64 ounces. But that's the size of the bottle. So yeah, and I love that stuff. I mean, with Jamaican black castor oil, I know that seems expensive, but a little goes a long way. 
so it'll last you for a while but yeah that's my video i definitely suggest y'all go out and buy these products if y'all are suffering from dry scalp like i was and um if y'all got any questions comments let me know any more other hair products y'all want me to review y'all want me to do more wig reviews wig installs whatever let me know again thank y'all for watching my channel i love and appreciate all of you and i'll see you guys back in my next video